Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of the Island playthrough series. So I'm just chilling out at the base right now, but I would like to see if we can head out and find ourselves a dire bear. I really want to go out and try and collect some honey with it so we can use a beehive for our greenhouse, which is going to be getting built sometime in the near future. So that is the plan for today. Hopefully we can head to the redwoods and find a decent dire bear. I'm not too concerned about the level because it's really just to collect a bit of honey. So that is the plan today. Let's um, get ourselves set up or almost set up. I think we're pretty good actually. I think I might have got everything organized before. Got my structures, spyglass, cryopods, trank stuff. Yep, I think we're good. Yeah, so as I was saying, I want to um, tame a dire bear. Hopefully there are some around the redwoods. I'm not sure how rare they are on the island. Um, but yeah, hopefully we can get a dire bear and find some beehives, which is probably going to be the next mission, actually. I'm not really sure where to find beehives. I know they just sporadically spawn around little small cliffs like the one in front of me. Um, but yeah, we'll try and get the dire bear out the way, and then hopefully some beehives will be close by. Alright, so we're just flying around the edge of the redwoods at the moment, and I can see quite a few alphas around, which is a little bit concerning. Uh, there is quite a monstrous alpha carno... Wait, sorry, that's that's level 10. Hmm, where... I saw a level 130 Kano, Alpha Kano in here just a second ago. Are there two of them? That's definitely level 10. Hmm, okay, well hopefully... We can we can actually kill that level 10 uh, Kano if we have to. But probably not the level 130 Alpha Kano. No way. Not with this uh, tamed RG. I'd probably need an imprinted one for that. But we are still yet to spot a Dire Bear. So we'll uh, we'll keep flying around the edge here, and hopefully we can spot one from the edge. Um, going into the redwoods is just a little bit scary. There's just so many things that can uh, knock me off my bird. You know, you got Archaeopteryxes, you got uh, what are those anteater-looking things that uh, like ground dinos? Uh, what are they? Pol, polva, polva something? I don't know. Polvia? I don't know. Those nasty things. Anyway. Oh, let's see. I suppose we can creep in a little bit. Just got to watch the trees for uh, those thylers. I don't want no thylid pouncing on my face. There's actually a lot of beehives in here, but I'm not really sure how to... Um, if they're on a tree like that, how do you get it with a diabear? You can't climb trees with a diabear. Is this an explorer note? Yay! Oh, I've got an achievement. Experienced Explorer. What's that, like 20% of all Explorer notes on the map, I think? Something like that. But that is not the mission today. The mission is a dire bear. Um, I'm pretty sure the Redwood is meant to be full of them, but maybe I'm just looking in the wrong spot. And they shouldn't be too hard to spot either. They're not small. I think there might be another Explorer note over there if I haven't already got it. I've been doing quite a lot of exploring of the uh, of the island off camera, so I'm a bit unsure as to how many notes I have and haven't got. Um, yeah, I see a Dodecarus right there. I spent so long looking for Dodecaruses the other day, it was not not even funny. Hours and hours spent. Um, but anyway, let's see, we'll keep keep venturing through the redwoods here. Ooh, is that a monkey? It is. It's a Gigantopithecus, level 80. Hmm. That could be kind of fun to tame one of those. Not right now, obviously, but I think in the in the future that'd be pretty cool. I've never, never really had a Megapithecus before. No, no, not Megapithecus. A uh, Gigantopithecus, or whatever it's called. Apparently you can throw yourself really far with those. So I've, uh, I've yet to try that. Lots of monkeys, not many bears. I'm always on the lookout for a decent RG too, so I can eventually breed um, breed the RG I currently have. Because imprinted RG would be super useful, especially when killing alphas and whatnot. Oh, 
I thought that was a dire bear. That's a bloody megatherium. The way it was walking on all fours for a second just kind of looked like a bear. And then it stood up like the megatheriums do. Just gonna land for a second and see if I can spot one. Hmm. Hey, what's that? Die bear. Level 40. Hmm. Should we tame it? Level 40. I mean, to be honest, like, what else are we really going to use it for apart from collecting honey? I'm not sure it needs to be high level. Uh, let's see. How about we keep a note of where this die bear is and we'll do a quick fly around. Um, the area, and then we'll, if we don't find one, we'll come back to the level 40. I think that's a good idea. Just in case there's a slightly higher one around. Maybe like a level 70 or 80 could be could be alright. The halfway point to max seems seems like a good plan. Again, I just want to really watch these trees and make sure I'm not uh, going to get pounced on by a thyla. That die bear was actually quite hard to spot too, considering it's a big ass bear, but um, I guess the redwoods has a lot of shade in it, so it kind of makes it harder to spot these things. Um, Alright, we'll perch here and just have a little scout around with the spyglass. Another Gigantopithecus over there. Oh, you pesky little things. Why? Just like, why suicide like that? Um, is that a bear down there? It's a brown It's a brown looking one, I think. Oh, get out the way. Level 40 as well, hmm. Okay, well, I think, um, do I prefer the brown or the black bear? I think the black bear actually looks quite cool. Alright, we're going to head back to the original bear that we found, and we'll try to tame this one. I think it's just along this ridge. What's that down there? Oh, it's a megalos megalosaurus. Or megalosaurus. So the way I'm planning on taming this, hopefully it works, but basically we're just going to lay out a couple of foundations, uh, surround it with door frames, and then have a ramp that leads into the trap. So hopefully the bear will follow me, I can run run over the ramp, and it's going to land in the trap, and I can just run through the door frame and get out. But I've not tamed one of these in quite a long time, I'm not really sure. My one concern is that maybe it will run quite fast, and therefore it'll go up the ramp and just shoot right over the all the all the length of my foundations and exit the trap but we'll see uh oh is that one of those nasty perlovia things oh it's a saber tooth wait ah you can't attack my bear come on just gonna dump this thing off the edge all right oh wait did the bear follow me shit it did oh man Please don't die. Okay, now never mind. The snake's on it instead. Okay, looks like we are indeed going back to the other level 40 that we saw. Going on a bit of a bloody merry-go-round over here. Back and forwards to different bears. You know what? I'm going to stop and get this yellow drop really quickly. I mean, it landed right in front of me. It would be silly not to get it. Oh, Gilly and an Apprentice. Oh, actually, Apprentice Baryonyx said, oh, that's not too bad. I would like to um, tame a Baryonyx and maybe even a Thyla, a Baryonyx and a Thyla, just for some caving, which I want to do pretty soon. So there might be a video uh, with Baryonyx or Thyla taming. 
I think I'll probably do the Baryonyx first, um, just to get the easy caves out the way, and then maybe the Thyla for the harder caves, I'm not really sure yet, but definitely stay tuned for uh, either of those videos. Alright, where was that dive at? I completely forgot where it was, I think it was up here. Uh, just down here, yeah there it is, I see it. Now hopefully there's nothing dangerous on the floor here. Alright, so I think... Oh shit, what's that? That kind of scared me a little bit. Uh, pick a Mastix, that's alright. And a whole bunch of Trudons, which I don't like. I'm just gonna kill these really quickly before I land. Nothing worse than army of Trudons, man. Oh god. Alright, you wanna die? Let's die. You first. Where is he? Did he run away? I oh, know there he is. Alright, that one's dead. Now... Wait, did my dive here run away? It's so dark, I can't see anything. Uh, oh, there it is. It's down there now. Okay, I guess we can... I might still set up on this hill. Uh, actually, the deploy my aggro if I get too close to it. Is it aggro? No, it's not. It's eating. Okay. Behave. Uh, another Pegomastix, man. This is a nightmare. Okay. Uh, we've got to find a good area to set up. I don't want this to go horribly wrong like most of my teammates do. Uh, if I, okay, there it is. Wait, are there two of them there? There are. A level 55 and a 40, okay. I mean, we could, we could try and tame both. I don't see why not. If, if they're both together, then they can probably go into the trap together. Let's see, you want a straight line running. Wait, are they chasing me? Are they chasing? Yeah, they are. Shit. Okay, we'll lead you up the hell of it. Okay. Oh, they're still chasing. Holy. These bears are angry. I didn't realize the aggro range was so, um, so close. Okay. It seems like they're still angered. Okay, I'm going to fly right up into the sky. Just to line of sight them, and then um, hopefully the aggro drops. Didn't expect the aggro range to be so massive, but that's alright. Let's see, are they, are they dropping aggro? Okay, there they are. I'm wondering if the aggro is just completely massive. If we sit up here. This terrain might be a bit of an issue. Yeah, my ramps aren't going to be... Man. I need to set up down the hill, I think. It's... Okay, they're staying passive. That's awesome. Right there, I don't think. I'm really scared something's going to jump out of a bush. I hate the redwoods. Okay, something did jump out of the bush. It was a pick of mastics though, so not too bad. Okay, now leave me in peace, please. I've got a bear to tame. Alright, we want... Okay, seems like they are still not aggressive, that's good. Still not aggressive. Okay, let's hope this works. Um, this is a pretty half assed trap to be honest. Um, they might shoot straight over the edge, um, but we'll see. 
I wonder instead of running aggro them, I could just fly the bird and aggro them that way. Uh, let's see if we can get two bears in the same trip at the same time. That would be pretty cool. Come on. Why, why are they not aggroing now? Okay. They're deciding to be friendly right now. Okay, maybe we will park. Okay, this Diplo needs to die. I'm sorry. I aggroed it. I don't know why a herbivore is so aggressive and fly nearer to aggro's. That makes no sense, but... This thing might actually give us prime meat, which we're going to need to tame the diver anyway. Hopefully. Wonderful, you got yourself stuck on a rock. Smart one. Okay, can I finally get to taming a bear now? Gonna park you right here. You should be safe. Hopefully. Maybe. Let's... Okay, the bear is right there. Let's see, I'll just get my gun out really quick. Uh... Okay, I think it's definitely on its way. Yep. Hooray, I got it. I got two of them. Ha, huh, they worked perfectly. I knew that would work, sort of. All right, let's knock these things out. I can't believe that actually worked. I mean, of course I knew it worked. Oh, what was that? Okay, never mind. That was a leaf. A leaf scared me. All right, let's shrink these things. Two females. Could have been a male and a female. That would have been more perfect than what it is now, but don't really plan on uh, going out of my way to breed them unless I actually happen to get a male and a female. So let's focus on this female, level 40 female first. I'm just gonna really on edge being in here. Um, not on a flyer, it's kind of scary, but oh well. Hopefully this thing knocks out pretty soon. We've got plenty of trank darts, but Okay, is that the runaway? I think it's running away. There we are. I thought it dropped for a second. Uh, drop. Still not dropped, man. Taking a while. Oh, there we go. I think it's dropped now. Alright, this one. Oops. Oh, this one's level 55. I thought it was 40 and 45. Unless it's a third one. Hmm. No, we should be alright. I don't think I saw a third one. Unless these are just the cubs and a big mama bear is going to rush out of the woods, but I think that shit only happens in uh, horror movies. That epic arc music for the intense moment that we are in right now. Love it. Gotta love it. I wonder if these bears actually have headshot modifiers. I'm not too sure if they do or not. Uh, can we get a headshot? No, they don't. Okay. That's alright. Oh, I didn't check their tall floor right either. Uh, hopefully it's slow. I don't bring any narcotics with me. I did not bring any narcotics. It's unlike me, I'm normally pretty prepared, but... Wait, what's that? No, nope, the rocks get me. Okay, both unconscious. Let's check the tour paws. Okay, I feel like definitely a slowish tour paw rate, so these shouldn't take too long to tame up at all. So we're gonna fly around. Um, we've only got three prime, so we might need to just 
hopefully we don't forget where these guys are, but we'll try and find some prime meat. Uh, there's a diplo here, we can kill that, definitely. This is why I need to breed Argies, just get this, this killing over the way a bit quicker. I'm already taming, uh, sorry not taming, I'm already breeding some really nice uh, Pteranodons, but I've already got uh, a couple of health mutations on them, but I mean Pteranodons aren't really that useful, it's more just a bit of a side project. Um, most breeding is fun, so I just, why not? Uh, Do we get any prime from that thing? We got a little bit. Um, I'll chuck some raw meat in there just in case the prime meat uh, is not enough. Let's see, we'll give two to that one and three to this one. Okay, it's gonna, might be a while. That's all right, um, let's see. We'll just give them a bit extra. I think they eat meat. I think they eat berries and meat. All right, we're just gonna chill out around this trap and defend them against anything that tries to attack them while they're taming. And I will see you guys in a second. Alright, so the lower dire bear, lower level dire bear uh, tamed first. This guy right here looks pretty cute actually. I'll uh, leave it up to you guys to give it a name. So leave a name in the comment section and that is what we can name it. And unfortunately we don't have a saddle for this thing yet, but we'll uh, crow put it up for now. Hopefully the other dire bears tames up pretty quickly. Not long to go, 82.8% tame. All right, the second dire bear is tamed. Yay, now we have two dire bears. All right, let's get you crow potted. We're going to head back to the base, craft a couple of saddles. Hopefully we can afford the resources. Um, and then we will go find some uh, beehives to go and steal honey from. Uh, let's see, where's my base? Where is the base? This way. Okay, let's go. Oh, I see a pip and drop. Okay, let's get that before you fly any further towards the base. Ah, oh, there's a turbid. Go away. I need my pip and drop. Fucking grab this. What is that? Diplos, okay. We have actually reached um, the electricity kind of age, so. We will definitely be grinding up some stuff now. We do have a, I do have a grinder, uh, industrial forge, fridges, obviously an electrical generator, um, fabricator, all that kind of stuff. So it's really good that we've finally uh, gotten out of the primitive kind of era and headed into a more advanced, advanced age. It's pretty cool. All right, home sweet home. Let's throw these divers out. Let's see. Just put them over here. So like I said, if you guys have any cool names for the bears, then uh, feel free to drop it in the comments and we can uh, see what we can do about naming it that. This one definitely looks pretty cool. I like this black one here with the brown on the top. That's the higher level one as well. Definitely pretty cool. It would be fun to breed these just for a little side project. Get some cute little uh, baby cubs. Anyway, let's see what we can do about crafting this dire bear saddle. Can we craft it just straight from the inventory? Yes, we can. Okay, let's see. Uh, I might be running low on some ending paste, but... Okay, we can only craft one saddle, but that's fine. We can't ride two at once. And I'll put away the stuff I got from that drop as well. Uh, let's see. We got the saddle, and we got some uh, armor... And we got a blueprint as well, so we'll put that away. And I will also put away some of my stuff. I'm not going to need it. Um, we'll keep that out just in case, but the rest of it can go away. All right. Nice. So we're taking this one out. Oh, wow, it's fast. Okay. Uh, so does right-click do anything with these guys? Okay, right-click harvests berries and fiber by the looks of it. 
And then that's just a basic attack. Oh wow, okay. C... Wait, can you climb with these? C seems to be like some kind of climbing animation, so... Maybe you can. I, I was under the impression that you couldn't climb with the beers. That's why it made no sense to see like beehives growing up way up trees and on cliffs and stuff. But um, I'm going to cry with the RG. Just in case we run into tr any trouble while we're out there, I can quickly uncrow the RG because I doubt the bear is going to be able to defend itself against much since it is quite low. But we will, um, we will see if we can find a beehive. Hopefully there's some close by the base. Wow, this thing is really quick. Shit. Didn't think it was that fast. That's cool. Oh, let's just be careful going off the edge here. Alright, let's go. We're going on an adventure. Let's see, there might be some beehives on this cliff here. It looks like a cliff that would uh, have beehives on it. Let's see what we got. I love how that sprint just speeds up as you, the longer you hold it. That's so cool. Oh, there's a Megapithecus down there. Hey, little guy. Oh, a Mesopithecus, not a Megapithecus. Oh, you scared of me. Okay, bye. Hmm. Uh, no. I really hope we don't run into anything nasty. I guess the good thing about taming two of them, at least one dies, uh, we still got the other one as a backup, but I would prefer to keep this one. It's stand lasts a long time as well, actually. Oh wow, shit, it does go quick. Oh, Explorer No, I don't think I've got this one yet. If we can get over there? No, we can't. Okay, let's oh, turn around. Move your big butt. Let's go around this way. Here we go, over here. It doesn't look like it's open, so we can probably get this one. Get some levels for the beer. Get your big butt in there. Oh, it is open. Never mind. Oh shit, snake. Ah! That thing was meshed into the rock. Oh, okay. Let's just um, continue with the journey here. Wow, it's actually kind of hard to dodge all the trees when you're going that quick. Wait, is there another... Why are these snakes here? Are we close to the swamp? Oh, so the swamp is just down there, isn't it? Alright, I wish beehives were just everywhere, but I don't want to go back to the redwoods for one, that's just... I can see my dive getting killed pretty quickly if I head back to the redwoods with this thing. Let's just run along this cliff. If I don't find one uh, in, on this cliff, then we'll fly around with the RG and see if we can spot some from there. Hmm, there's like nothing on this cliff. That sucks. Okay, let's drop down here carefully. Oh, there we go. Um, I saw a spino over there, so I'm just gonna ignore that area. <laughs> the swim animation is pretty cool as well. It's actually quite accurate and realistic. Oh, piranha on my butt. Now I know there are some beehives. I've seen them before on these little rock obelisk things. But there are none here today. So sad. Oh, okay. Let's try over here, I guess. Um, geez, I heard a running animation and it scared the crap out of me. I think that was just my own animation, though. Oh, we're bound to see a beehive. Oh, look at that. Right there. We found one. That was so lucky. Okay, how do we harvest? Is it just left? Attack for honey. Okay, left click. Wait. Oh, okay, it's right click. Damn, okay, it's right click, not left click. My bad, bees. Forgive me. Alright, let's see if we can find some more uh, down this little... Whatever this is, a driveway chasm thing, I don't know. Um, we need 50, I think, for the beehive, the S plus domestic beehive, so... We need, um, what, like two more? Three more? Well, two, yeah, we need three more. Three more beehives to get enough honey to craft one. Okay, there is no more around here that I can see, so we'll head back to where we came. Jeez, this thing is quick. That's so awesome. 
Imagine this thing running at you. Holy shit. You would crap your pants. I would crap my pants. Alright. Let's just keep walking around here. Stroll through the jungle on the back of a dive here. Um, I'm just gonna ch I guess we just check the cliffs. I think that's probably the best way to like look for honey. Just look around all the cliffs. Oh, there's a psycho down there. Uh, hmm, I can't see any from on this cliff. Don't fall, don't fall. Oh! That was lucky. A cool little flat area up here, actually. This could definitely be a uh, base location. Not for me, but I've already got my base, but... Definitely for someone else. Um, I can't see any... Can't see any more beehives around here. Oh, I see one right up there. Let's go. They stand out quite a bit, so that's that's good. Now, how do we reach this? Oh, we should be able to reach it from the little cliff, actually. Wait, this thing's just floating in mid-air. Oh, come on. Oh, is it on a... Does it have a cooldown? Okay, 15 minute cooldown. Okay, I can only... Okay. We're just going to keep running away here from the... Uh, from the snake. Another beehive. Yay! We're getting lucky today. Don't slide down the cliff. We want to go, like, around like this. Alright, nice. We should probably test if these things can cl- Oh, a bunch of raptors. I'm running this way. Actually, we're really close to the swamp. I'm tempted to actually, uh... To crow pod the bear and fly. Uh, where is my- where's the obelisk? Where's my base? Okay, my base is this way. Let's see, how much honey do we have so far? We got... Okay, that's not really telling me a lot. I thought it would say item added. Blah, 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 blah. Six. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, so we've got like 44 honey. So we need one more beehive. I don't want to face those raptors. With, we're just a little baby. We can't afford to be taking on a pack of raptors. We're going to head back this way, I think. Oh, come on. Jump the river. Oh. That water looks disgusting. Alright. Let's see, I don't think we... I saw the glow of an alpha. Hopefully I'm wrong. Yeah, I think I'm wrong. I think I'm just paranoid. Let's... Oh, okay, we found another one. Yeah. Let's check the water really quick. I don't... Uh, there's a baryonyx. I don't like that sound. There's something in the water. Can I kill that Baryonyx? What level is it? Level 20? Okay. Uh, I think we can probably try. Please don't die. That's a long level up animation. Oh wow, 107 damage? Shit, I didn't think that would, bear would hit that hard. Wow. That is surprising. Okay. Now we can see. Nothing dangerous in the water, please. Okay, there's a piranha, but... Not anymore. Another piranha. Let's just get these things. Okay, uh... I don't think we're gonna be able to reach that, but... We can try. No, we can't reach it. That sucks. Why do the beehives spawn in such stupid places? I mean... I don't think the bear can climb. We haven't tested it yet. We should probably test it. Uh, oh, big boy Spino. Level, actually, level 10. We could probably kill this thing. Attack me. No, he's scared. Yeah, he's scared. Okay. Um, can we climb a can we climb a tree maybe? Let's see if we can climb a tree. What does that do? Is, it, is that just some kind of like 
taunt or like a pose. Uh, I thought that was like a climbing animation. Okay, I guess not. Um, let's go further up here. Oh, it slowed me down. I had a tree. Game over. Have we checked this cliff? Oh, there's those raptors. Okay. We want to avoid that. Let's see. Let's just check this little corner here. Wait, is that an, that's an explorer note that I haven't got yet. Nice, I'll take that. Okay. Oh, I'm stuck. Bear's got a big butt. Alright. Um, I'm a bit lost as to where we should go next. I'm running out of ideas. Oh man, I hit something again. This takes practice. Oh shit, okay. Oh, he's, he's, he's aggro towards us now. Or he's running. No, he's coming back, okay. Alright, we can definitely take that thing. Easy. You ain't running away from me, buddy. You're dead. What does right click do? Okay, looks like it gives us more hide, maybe? I don't know. Uh, let's cross the river. I'm pretty... I'm, I'm feeling a little bit more confident on this dive bear now. I'm not too scared... Um... Of the lower level thing so we can tr probably venture out a little bit more into the swamp and see if we can get some beehives around this cliff over here because I mean we're killing level 10 spinos we're killing baryonyxes um, we should be okay there is no beehives around this cliff though and this is the same cliff I was at earlier. Alright, there are some cliffs just below our base. So, we'll check those cliffs. If there's none there, I think I'm going to take the RG out and just have a quick fly around for the last beehive. Oh, off the cliff. Okay. No beehives there. Okay, one more cliff close to the base. Just this one over here. Not seeing any beehives so far. Not seeing any... Oh, we'll go this way. Holy crap, I can't get over how quick this bear is. That is nuts. Faster than any flyer I've got, I'm pretty sure. Oh, 11 levels. Okay, that must have come from the Spino. Let's just check how many... I don't think I've got it. Oh, there it is. 45. Okay, we need f literally five more honey. Um, what is the best thing to level for these guys? I have no clue. Probably health. I mean, health is always good. It doesn't go up that much. Um... We'll go to 2k health, and then we'll go the rest in damage. I'm not sure if uh, melee damage affects the honey harvesting, but... It won't hurt to put a few points into damage. Alright, we're gonna... Um, I think we're gonna go back to the base. I'm gonna put this honey that we currently have in the fridge. I'm not sure what the spoil timer is. I think it lasts a while, but I'm gonna put it in the fridge just in case. Um, let's just get all the honey. We can ignore everything else. Nothing else in there we need. Okay, we're gonna fly back to the base and yeah, put the honey in the fridge and then... I'll fly around in the RG and see if I can find one more beehive, um, and then I'll probably... Then we'll probably go back to the base and craft the beehive. I'm just going to store the beehive, the domestic beehive, uh, for now, and then I'll definitely be, um... Probably doing a greenhouse build of some kind in the next couple of episodes, so I'll be using the domestic beehive in that build for the greenhouse. Um, I do want to get, like... 
the greenhouse, a kibble farm, um, and all that kind of stuff set up so we can start focusing more on the battle boss type dinos to um, start exploring the caves and then eventually moving on to the bosses. So that is the plan. Um, but yeah, we'll put the honey in the fridge for now. Let's see. I don't have a fridge for honey, but that's fine. We'll just put it in here. Here, honey. Here. God, what is that typing? Alright, that is all the honey that we had so far. So I'm going to head out on the RG. Try to find one more beehive, and then I will see you guys back here. Alright, so we actually just revisited the very first beehive that we went to uh, on the dive bear, and we got our last piece of honey. So... I'm just heading my way, uh, heading back to the workshop area. Uh, oh, this thing is really hard to control when you're going full out. Turn this guy around. All right. Now, here's my extra honey that I got. Let's see, 15 honey. Yep, good. Hopefully, um, we can actually craft a domestic beehive, but no biggie if we can't. We can always leave that. Later, let's see. Oh, 250 rare flower. I don't have that much rare flowers. I have. Uh, I have 61 rare flowers. Okay, so we're not going to be crafting a domestic beehive for this video, but we did tame a dire bear. We did collect honey. That was the uh, the main goal of today. All right, guys, that is going to be it for today's episode. If you're enjoying the series so far and you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, go ahead and subscribe and turn on the notification bell so you can watch the next episode when it comes out. If you like this video, you can support the channel by smashing the like button and leaving a comment down below. Thank you for watching and I'll see you all in the next episode.